Hey guys, the main man action here, bring guys some more Undertale. In the last part, we helped two uh, warriors get together and we did some puzzles. And next, in this part, we are continuing on with the game. I, I say that every single time because I honestly do not know what the hell is going on in this game. What the fuck was that? Did you hear what they just said? They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I heard they hate spiders. I heard they love to stomp on them. I heard they they like to tear their legs off. I'm sorry, I'm not that that weird. Anyway, let's keep going through it. I heard I can't move anymore. That they are awful, awfully stingy with their money. You think your taste is too refined for our pastries, do you? Don't you, dearie? <laughs> I disagree with that notion. I think your taste is exactly what this ba next batch needs. Muffet traps you. Uh, hey, money? Oh, I can give her money. All right. Trixie battle. Muffet will will immediately force you onto onto a series of horizontal threads when the battle begins, and you need to hop from thread to thread to avoid the spiders that clamber among them. <laughs> clamber among them. That gets harder and harder as you go along, because not only do the spiders get faster and more numerous, they're joined they're joined by bouncing balls and boomerang ish ish things. Wow, this is. This is a good song. I've I've been saying this for the entire game, but shit, like there are lots of good songs in this game. Wow, I think the purple is better better look than you. You're trapped in a strange purple web. Oh, it gets more expensive every single time I do it. What what can I do? The attack for this turn. Okay, that's pretty easy. What's the struggle to do? I can't really do anything to her, apparently. Up next. Can I fight her? Up to sports to a couple of spiders. Struggle? You struggle to escape the web. Muffet laughs and claps your hands. I can't really do anything apparently. Muffet pulls a couple of couple of spiders. No, I'm not gonna do anything. He invites you to to her parlor, excuses excuses herself. Oh, hi, Rudy. I want to introduce my new pet. It's breakfast time, isn't it? Have fun, you two. What the fuck? Oh, God. Fucking hell. Damn, son. That pet of yours is kinda crazy. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet is amused by your antics that she's giving you give you a discount. Alright. Muffet does a synchronized dance with the spiders. You struggle to escape the web, nothing happens. Offer us a lot of money offer us a lot of money for your soul. Spiders clamp along with the music. <laughs> uh, after a number of rounds, we'll also sick a pet or you. You'll have to flee upwards while avoiding more spiders. It's a simple enough dodging game. 
nearly no tricks to it. Though, if you want to lower the damage you take, you can. The more you bribe her, the more it costs each time. The battle ends when you kill Muffet or bribe enough rounds, which will take a while. You can eat, you can also end it by using one of the spider items. I don't know. She has a lot of HP, that's the thing. Thought is the web around you. What the fuck? How you dodge that? It's like boomerangs. I'm either gonna kill her or I'm gonna Wow, I'm actually shocked that I didn't take any damage there. Uh crab apple. Just be maxed out. Okay, mine is tied as the rev around you. I have a fighter or I just leave her alone. But the thing is hmm, got the D. Even if they go under under the door, Snowdin's fatal cold is impassable alone. Oh, I can move left and right. I didn't know that. Muffet pours you a cup of spiders. But from the money from your soul, we'll be able to rent a them a healing limo. Okay. So there's a secret line stacks with the other spiders. And with all the leftovers, we could have a nice vacation, or even build a spider baseball field. Fuck me. Spiders clap along with the music. I think she's at half health now. Okay, now. Fuck me! God's sake, woman! She's quick! We got a f speed. God's sake, her pet. This attack is. You're still alive? <laughs> oh, my pet looks like it's time for dessert. Huh? A telegram from the spiders in the ruins? What? They're saying what they saw you. So you helped donate to their cause? Oh my, this is this has been all a big misunderstanding. I thought you were something that hated spiders, the person who asked for that soul. They must have been a different human in a striped shirt. Sorry for all the trouble. Ooh -hoo -hoo. I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime and, uh, and for no time I'll wrap you up and, and let you play with my pet again. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Just kidding. I'll spare you for now. Thank you. God's sake, it was either kill her or that's that was fun. See you again, dearie. That wasn't fun for me. Man, I'm sweating buckets right now. <laughs> anyway, that was that was that was interesting. That is supposed to from Metaton's latest performance. A strategic tale of two star crossed lovers kept apart from the ties of tale. Looks like it's almost time for their performance. Oh, that human? Could it be? My one true love. Metaton is one weird motherfucker. If you're gonna kill me, just kill me. You know? Like, why go through all this book?
You can't die a lot. You only die once. So sad. So sad that you are going to the dungeon. Well, doodles. Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh heavens. Sermons have mercy, the horrible colored tile maze. Each colored tile has its own sadistic function. For example, a green tile sounds a noise, and then you must fight a monster. Red tiles will actually wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? That's right. You remember all the rules, don't you? Great. Then I won't waste time repeating them. Oh, and you'd better hurry. Because if you don't get there in 30 seconds, you'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. <laughs> My poor love, I'm so filled with grief, I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. I don't know how you do this. Ah, oh, man. I'm stuck. Okay. Thanks. Up. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Looks like you're out of time. Here comes the flames, darling. They're closing in. Getting closer. Oh, my. Any minute now. Ring. Watch out! I'll save you! I'm hacking into the firewall right now! Oh no! How could this happen? Fooled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys. That's right! Come on, Metaton, give up already! You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as we work together. Your puzzle's over. Now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle... over? Alphys, darling. What are you talking about? Did you forget about what what the green tiles do? They make a sound. Then you have a monster fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me. Fuck off. That's done. Alright, can I run from this? That's done. That be and a fight. That was quite easy. So let's skip it, right? Okay, so Metaton, yell, you yell. Nothing happened. That's it, then. Let's say goodbye. Is that your phone? I bet it, you'd better on them. Hey, this is this, this is bad, but don't worry. The, there's one last thing I stole in your phone. You see that yellow button? Go, go to this phone at menu and press it. Yellow. You press the yellow button. The phone is resonating with the Metaton's presence. Is it? This is it, darling. What the hell? Now press Z. Get your ass whooped! Fire! Oh, 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 you've defeated me. How can this be? You're stronger than I thought you were, etc. L looks like you beat him. You did a really great job out there. Uh, all thanks to you. Oh. What? Oh no, I mean, you were the you were the you were the one doing everything cool. I just I just wrote some silly programs on, for your phone. Um, hey, this might sound strange, but can I tell you something? 
Before I met you, I didn't really, I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I f f felt like a total screw up. Like I couldn't do anything without, without ending up letting up, letting everyone down. But but, guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So thanks for the help. Thanks for letting me help you. Uh. Anyway, we're almost to the call. It's just past the MTT resort. Come on, let's finish this. All right, let's go. Ah, it's those two guys again. Oh, hey, we're like taking a rain check on that killing you thing. Like, don't tell Undine about this, okay? He seems happy. Hey, it's you again. Business excellent here. These two fellas brought all my ice cream. It's actually sold out of everything. Sorry. Wait, you still got got something for you? I've still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? Yeah. Apparently, in the guide, if you kill those two, he still has ice cream. No. Yeah. If you kill those two, if you kill them, he still has ice cream for you. I think. I think that's how it works. I don't know. Anyway, we were there before. We don't need to be there anyway. Uh, what does this take us? Oh, this is where... Hey, hey, did you remember my name? Did you? Yeah. What? You remember? How could I be so easily defeated? Okay, mate. I'm pretty sure that's a way to go down or something like that. I don't know. Anyway, let's go north. Ah, it sounds again. Hey. Go up, go up the creepy alleyway on the right for some great deals. Creepy alleyway on the right. I don't know. Hey, I heard you going to the core. How about grabbing dinner with me first? Okay. Great. Thanks for treating me. Over here, I know a shortcut. Well, here we are. So. Your journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, but though, though, maybe something is is better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got f food, drink, friends. Is what you have is what you have to do really worth it? Oh, uh, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Hey. Let me tell you a story. So, I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I see out there what for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's a huge locked door. And it's perfect for practicing knock knock jokes. For one day, I'm knocking them out like usual. I knock in the day and say, knock knock, and suddenly from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So, naturally I respond, dishes. This is who? Dishes are a bad, very, a very bad joke. I don't get it. Then she just howls with laughter, like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So, I keep her coming, she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever heard. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could yodel. Wow, well, needless to say, this woman is extremely good. Oh, I get it. We kept, we kept telling each other to jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Papyrus gets kind of cranky about his bedtime story. <laughs> but she told me to come by again. So I did. Then I did again and again. It's a thing now. Turning bad jokes from the door. It's rolls. <sighs> one day. One day, though. I noticed she wasn't very laughing very much. I asked her what was up. And she told me something strange. 
if a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? Now, I hate making promises. And this woman, I don't even know her name, but someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't say no to. Do you get what I'm saying? That promise I made to her. You know what would ha have happened if she, if she hadn't said anything, buddy? You be dead where you stand. Hey, line up, bugger. Bucko. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? Not really. I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Hey, I've died multiple times actually. What's what, what's that supposed to be? What's that look supposed to be? Am I wrong? Hey. Well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Cause someone really cares about you. I think I have an idea of who that person is. <sighs> anyway, originally we dug we dug mazes with puzzles in order to foil human attacks. But now building things winding and confusing, it's all some old tradition. You can't go uh, two feet without being up to your armpits in the puzzle. Puzzles. I work at the core. It's inside. The inside is a maze. Okay. Swap of parts. Then that means we can reshuffle the layer at will. Boy, was today a fun day. I sure love puzzle. I'm the, I'm the resort comedian. I see very, I'm very funny. People laugh at my jokes. Now, my son, you want he wants to be a comedian like his father, but his jokes aren't funny. He tells this awful pun. He tells this awful puns. He's he tells these awful puns. He's an embarrassment to our family. <laughs> That's not funny. Since his mother passed away, he couldn't stand living at home anymore. So he ran away. I haven't seen him since. I'm a terrible father. Ha ha ha. That's not funny. It's not funny at all, mate. He just lost his son. I wonder where this way goes. Okay. As I came in, I realized I forgot to make a reservation. I didn't want to look like I messed up, so I kept walking in anyway. Now I'm just kind of consuming dew of, of this ficus. <laughs> It's some kind of TV show featuring Metaton. Nearly every TV show features Metaton. What's so different about that one? I'm happy I talked to Sons there. Blub blub. You'll have to reserve the table to eat here. You also need to reserve your chair, your silverware, your food, your... Pretty much, okay, so reserve everything. <laughs> wow, okay. So, let's talk to this guy, lastly. Welcome to the MTT Resort. Hotlands, biggest apartment building turned hotel. Whether you're here for the night or here to stay, MTT Resort prides itself on on great stay. Just passing through, nice. MTT Resort prides itself on being passed through. <laughs> Is this the opening? Yeah. Apparently, there's something here. Before I end the episode, I want to check it out. Hey, check it out! Check it out! Hi. Uh, what you got to buy? You got junk food. Um, well, empty gun, bullets not included. Uh, attack uh, mystery key. Someone, hmm, someone's house. It's key to someone's house. What does that do? But the main one, uh, if uh, it will open, uh, uh, interesting. Interesting. Five. Five. You'll find signs. He wants. Okay. You should. You should. But the main thing you should buy is the mystery key. Okay, so I'll buy it. It opens the door to something that I can't get to because it's far away. Uh, I don't know how to get there. That's the thing. It opens the door to Nabstuk's thing. Uh, I'm going to see if I can find a way to get there. So I'll see you guys back here. Okay, so I found my way back 
to Napstuk's area. It wasn't. It was actually pretty close to where I was. Anyway, let's. Can we open this key? It's locked. Yeah, can I got the key? So can I use it? Item. Use the mystery key. The red door is unlocked. The key disappeared. Okay. Wow. Interesting house. For diary entries. Let's start from the left. Dear diary, Shirin's sister fell down recently. It's sad. Without her sister to speak to her, she's becoming more reclusive than ever. So I reached out to her and told her that she's that she, Bluki and I, should all perform together sometime. She, she seemed to like that idea. Okay, dear diary, I love collecting diaries. What does that do? Dear diary, I like I like to buy a new diary for every entry I make. I love to collect diaries. Whose house is this? My darling diary, I met someone someone interesting today. Last week I posted that advertisement for my human fan club. Today was the first meeting. Only one person, only one other person came. Honestly, she's a dork. And she's obsessed with these awful cartoons. She's kind of funny too. I want to see her again. Diary, my dear. My diary collection is going fabulously. I have like five now. Dear diary. She surprised me with something today. Sketches of a body that she wants me to create. She wants to create for me. A form beyond my wildest fan fantasies. In a form like that. I could finally feel like myself. After all, there's no way I can be a star the way I am now. Sorry, Bluki. My dreams can't wait anymore. I can't get past these diaries, so I can't look anyway. Anyway, uh, I guess that's going to be the end of today's part. Uh, pretty, sh pretty interesting one for there. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did enjoy the video. And of course, Subscribe for more and I'll see you guys later for some more Undertale. Peace!